Okay, guys. Uh, this is your boy Captain Krupp on the microphone. I got a very special guest here today, guys. Oh my gosh, no. Uh, say hello to the one and only Man Hatter. And oh my God, as I get into the introduction, here he's been escorted out of the stage, but he gives him a water bottle and a tank and go with it. Oh my God, he's trying to get back here. Doing a wonderful job. Oh, fortunately, does not hit the kid. El Nino. No, El Nino. I, I'm liking those nares. It, that's the fourth in a row. Can you get any more creative? Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, I'm liking these strings. Very nice string. Oh, we got Gatorade into up smash. Can can you already close out the stock? He really needs the stock, or else I can get even more extra credit. So what do you think, Mandy? What, what, what do you think Frost should do to? Uh, okay, that's what Frost should do. I think he, that's what Frost should, should do. Should, I think Frost did what he needed to do. Yes, he should jab F smash. He's just gonna... Yeah, he got the jab smash. So that was a very lightning game one here. Um, just just pure aggression coming from Frost. That's all. That's really what that was. Just aggression. Yeah. Just, I'm not gonna let you breathe. And, because I, I don't want to deal with your projectile. I feel like Frost has got some tough anger issues that just need to be worked out yeah, there. I, every time he sees a Richter, he's get, he gets reminded of the set he, he keeps having with Acetone. I think it's a, a consistent 3-1. Anyways, we're done bringing up the past. Sounds going, like a trauma response to me. Yes, we're going to go back to game two here. Smash, well, you know, I kind of like this pick, kind of don't. Uh, it works against Richter because, as, I mean, hopefully Frost is able to utilize it. Kind of do a zero to death, kind of. Rack up a lot of percent. A very base neutral here, and oh, one, two, buckle my shoe, three, four, and there's the parry to smash no more. Oh, wait, yeah, smash no more. <laughs> <laughs> that was nice. Thank you. Oh, frost caught in the in a loop, and oh, yeah, okay, you hit him with it. Yeah, I'm starting to see why smash was the easier pick because the F smash can go below the ledge like 100%. Get more angle off that, hit the up beat now. Boy, Frost just swinging at him. He's just like, if it hits, it hits. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I will keep swinging. And Yuri doing the same thing here. Nice patience. Ooh. Not sure if he should have gone away from that conversion, but Yuri breathing a sigh of relief. Able to play the stock a little more, but can he get out of this ledge or is that Night Night? Oh. You know, what a quick order to bail him out from the ledge. Very good, wow. very good patience here from from Yuria. He's holding shield more, and he's like, "Okay, if you're gonna keep hitting me, then you're gonna hit, catch this shield up, beat, bro." Oh, he didn't do it. He went for down tilt. Oh, he lived. All right, nice cross. He lived. In the cross, we trust. Eftel, he's he's still playing. He still has the stock. No, no he more. Was, oh, <laughs> I spoke too soon. <laughs> yeah, I spoke too oh, soon. I'm gonna say he wasn't about to give up that. This is a this is a nice game of competitive tag, you know. Prime is it, and Rick is trying to not get it. Basically, what this is, can't miss. And Gary doing a fantastic game here in game two as the mouse. Wow, very good timing on that up tilt. Oh, he hits him, hits him at the apex of the up beam. Do you know that's when he, when Prom is vulnerable? Is yeah. that the apex? Yeah, the apex, yeah, the very tip of the up beam. I did not, I'm learning yeah. something new every day. When he spins, he's vulnerable. Gary gonna identify the situation like he's identifying these ledge habits. Hello? Look at that. He's going crazy! He just dash attacked them like no one's business! Okay, here comes those nares. Might see what happens on Smashville. Or not. He's out. He's out! He rolled out, baby! He's out! B, this is going from bad to worse for Frost. Okay, he's responding here. Double up here to forward air. Racking some percent. Putting on that pressure. Yuri can't breathe! Is this the stock? No, it's not. That might be it. Jer. Right and true, Jer. But one thing about Krom is that if he hits you around 90 to 100% with his jam, with his jam, and when he does a little, <laughs> little curve with his sword, mm -hmm. it's a confirmed into a back air. All that is, well, we call that an SD. Unfortunately, you couldn't grab the legend. But the jam is a very nice move. It's the tried and true. Hey, give me that stop. Let's do yeah, Duke won. And uh, Yuri has something, like Yuri just keeps calling out those that ledge play. He's a very good ledge play here, very calling out those habits. He's like, okay, if you're gonna neutral get up, that's just forward, forward. You're gonna roll behind me, catch this up tilt, right quick. You're gonna jump, whammy, hit him with the back air. Back air, mm. back air is usually what's gonna take the stock in low percent. You know, you're gonna need to catch them hands. Yeah, <laughs> 
Oh my god. He has two? I mean, he did one for very clean. And uh, a nice little standoff coming out here. Gary pulling off with the lead, winning trade number one. Oh! Can you give him with the Gillette shit? Get out of that one. But can you get out of this one? A nice punish on the roll. Good back here. Dash tag coming through. I like the patience from Frost, but he didn't execute from a lingering, you know, fall. He got hit for it. Takes some notes from there, but you're smart from here identifying things. You're not going to just, just look at that. You're just baiting me. You ain't actually a Both players in the position to take the stock. Percents are very even here. Mm -hmm. Oh, but Yuri's at the ledge. You don't want to be at ledge against Roy. Very bad position, but he gets out every time. Every time he gets out, like, like he knows. He just knows how to get out. But he's catching these back ears. Like he just knows. Yeah, I'm gonna mm -hmm. catch these back ears. And so could this be it? One more call out. Wow. Yep, B. I I honestly, I, I don't know. This man knew. Which confidence. This is definitely a game of tag right now. Yeah, no one wants to be it. <laughs> oh, nice shield patience here. And oh, the up B. Praying for the shield drop. It didn't come. Back to ledge. What's the move? That shield is getting really small. Oh my god, and he gets out of ledge. Every time he gets to ledge, I'm like, is it going to happen? Is he going to get Croy? He just got Croy. I think Upgrade took it. <laughs> very uncommon, but as you just saw, 160%. Very high. Now, while, while Crumb is like, okay, if I hit you with anything, you're dead. Richter, not so much. Right now, Gary's struggling to try to find, well, Duke is trying, struggling to try to find a hit here. So we'll take the stock. And there it is. There's the back end. You jump, and he back in. I like the patience here. From both players. Duke retreating. But, oh, nice shield out there. We're seeing a lot more Gillette Razors. And oh my god. I just don't. He said if you shield this, it's gonna hit the platform. Technically, I'm still. Ross said, oh, that does that, bro? <laughs> <laughs> you learn new things every day, don't you? <laughs> yes. Oh, there we go. Ooh. I knew he was looking for that forward air. But he already had something to say about that. To get off of me, bro. And wow! Down the water to last for such a long time. And look at that accuracy. I feel like he's mastered the whip from the last time that I've seen him. He struggled to get those hits. Now he's looking like like a sniper. Oh, here comes, here comes the dubs partner. Whip and the boomerang. To my knowledge, I think Duke is down in sets against your, uh, against um, Frost. Excuse me. And this performance might be wrong. It's looking like a win. If Frost doesn't do anything right now, it's looking like lights because he's at ledge and disadvantage against Rick. Oh, but he got out. A glimmer of hope. Or is, your, is Duke going to use his iron fist to close this out? Downer's coming through. This is a very tense situation for Frost. I, you can feel in his inputs. He's fighting for his life. He knows. Knows what's on the line here. Oh, the F-Tilt coming yeah. through. Oh. And there we go. A nice pop-off from Yuri. Well-deserved victory. A good set from 